Hello viewers, this is Paladin of Odin, and this is some more Skyrim. This is episode 27. Yes, 27. Um, we just finished off the Red Eagle quest, and I decided to start on the Bards, because uh, there's like three side quests my position in my uh, I need quest to ask you to stop. That poetry. Not say I've heard of any laws against whatever that is you're doing, but I'll lock you up if I have to. You can try. I've got my eye on you. you might want to keep for both helping reopen the East them on company. Gonna have the this only so one eye. Uh, with only one time. eye, you don't it have any depth perception. To it. Not much, to be honest. Their return was a shock to us all. Gerard Germain has some tomes about them in the library, if you're interested. Uh, not much. But as a bard, I find the whole affair depressing. There if you want something a bard... A thousand years from now, Skyrim will have... Ch yes, according to Giraud. I need you to retrieve the poem. As you may be a... Elisif mourns... I tried to... Con I believe King Olaf's verse will provide that proof. So basically, you need you me to find a the poem verse. so that you can throw a party. All right. Who am I to stand Unless in the we way? Have specific business. I'm not interested. Who the hell are you? You talk to me. I didn't talk to you. Morthal. It's pretty much the closest place. Down in a dungeon, cross breath will actually be quite useful. I'm gonna take I am sworn to carry your razor from you so that you just automatically use Dawnbreaker. Because seriously. You know, Maroon's razor is kinda cool. Small chance to instantly kill costs twenty-five points of poison damage for five seconds. Hmm. I don't remember the poison damage. Was that the buff from the, um... Daedric Artifacts mod that I have on? Hmm. I don't remember. But, uh, either way, poison doesn't work on the undead. So, 
just use Dawnbreaker. Lead on. of a master lock. Oh, Kadeem! 
you're on my side, but uh, I can't really control the expansion of that thum. If you get in the way, you're gonna get hit. your job, Lydia. Your job is to kill them. I'm gonna try this because I remember this from yesterday. See if this works. Because I have to be perfectly honest, I don't know whether or not um, it's just a, uh, a static combination for all of Skyrim, or whether it uh, changes based on different times you play. Oh, got a bad feeling about this. Oh. Oh, 
You can't kill him. He's not really there. Seriously, Lydia. He's a ghost. I get it, he's undead, and I pissed, you know, I pissed off the game by spamming and basically turning him into an enemy, but he's a ghost. He's not actually there. You cannot kill him. behind you. I've been hunting and fishing Shaman. in these parts for years. college and uh, hand over that uh, poem so that we can start that party still here I got that poem ah, for you. Ya. I have to admit, I didn't think it would actually be there. Now, let's take a look at this. Oh, oh no, this won't do at all. The copy is incomplete. It's aged to the point that parts are unreadable, and the parts that are readable, well. Bardic verse has come a long way since ancient times. If you say so. It means I can't read it to the court. Without the verse, I won't be able to convince Elisif of the importance of the burning of King Olaf Festival. If she isn't convinced of the festival's importance, then she won't reverse her decision to stop the effigy burning. It means that the burning of King Olaf, which the Bard's College has held for time immemorial, won't be happening. So what, what can we do about it? Uh, I'm kind of interested in your party here. Make it up? That doesn't seem appropriate. 
I suppose I could copy his style based on what you brought me, but I have no idea what happened in between these verses. I'm no bard, but let's see what we can do. Oh, Olaf, our subjugator, the one-eyed betrayer, death-dealing demon and dragon-killing king, your legend is lies, lurid, and false. Your cunning capture of Numenex Hakan for the ages. King Olaf was Olaf One-Eye? He famously captured the dragon Numenex and took him to Dragon's Reach. What did we say really happened? Hmm. Eh, why not? I find that highly unlikely, but the court will love it. I'm writing it in. Olaf grabbed power by promise and threat. From fall grief to winter hold, they fell to their knees. But solitude stood strong, Skyrim's truest protectors. Olaf's vengeance was instant, inspired, and wicked. Strange. According to history, Solitude attacked Winterhold, but Asgir seemed to be saying Olaf reacted. What do we say happened? Let's stick with the... Oh, that is exciting! I'm sure the court on the Yarrow will love it. I'm, I'm writing it in now. It has a few final lines, but that's all we needed to add. I need to head to court immediately and present this. You should come. Okay. I mean, to be perfectly honest, dude, I don't see why you need me. I'm just the guy that found the book. The book was kind of useless, and we basically just wrote in some good parts. I do hope the court likes the verse. I and think we've done an excellent job. You're the writer. I'm just some crazy person who came up with wild theories that you thought you liked. So if this goes south, this is all on you. It's so good to court? see you again. Take a look. Alright, I know that we picked up some junk that we can sell. Oh, she doesn't have a whole lot of money. Let's... Yeah, we might as well pick those up. Take care of yourself, and always remember, the world is ripe with people looking to spill your blood. What are we waiting for? I do for? hope the court likes the verse. I think we've done an excellent job of recreating it. I think my voice is ready. I hope we've done this well. Get moving. I know the Jarl isn't here, but 
can you hurry this up? Not now. Ah, Viarmo. I assume you are here to petition for the reinstatement of the burning of King Olaf festival. I am, Jarl. Yeah, we'd like I to party. I wish to present King Olaf's verse from the Poetic Edda, recovered this very day from the Bard's tomb. You mentioned something that would convince us the festival should take place, but I didn't expect King Olaf's lost verse. Please proceed. Oh, Olaf, our subjugator, the one-eyed betrayer, Death-dealing demon and dragon-killing king, your legend is lies, lurid, and false. Your cunning capture of Numenex Hakan for the ages. No shouting match between dragon and man, and no fire or fury did this battle entail. Olaf was Numenex in human form. On moonless nights, he would spread wings and sail. Olaf grabbed power by promise and threat. From Falkreath to Winter Hold, they fell to their knees. But solitude stood strong. Skyrim. Hey, can I buy that beer that you had? I think I'm gonna need it. Olaf's vengeance was instant, inspired, and wicked. Olaf gave orders, winter hold disguises, an attack on solitude, total destruction to follow. His men dressed up and then went out to fight, but they reversed Olaf's orders much to winter hold's sorrow. So ends the story of Olaf the liar, a thief and a scoundrel. We of solitude commit to the fire. In solitude, bards train for their service. They also gather each year and burn a king who deserves it. You have proven your point, Viarmo. The festival is truly a celebration of solitude and a condemnation of false kings. I thank you, and the college thanks you, Jarl. Furthermore, I believe that such a fine poem deserves some payment of patronage. The college will be generously rewarded. Oh, thank you yet again. I will make sure our applicant, who was instrumental in um, recovering the poem, will be well rewarded. Applicant? Unbelievable! You have done us a great service here. I can't begin to thank you enough. Um. Soon. Soon. These things must be done properly. Hey, you I never wanted to be a bard in the, the first place. Itself. I need you to go speak to Yorn. He was preparing the effigy of King Olaf. You know, Tell him to finish the preparations. I kind of just smash the things in the face until they die. On. Not really a, a bard's thing. About this party. There he is. Ah, the bard to be. Don't call me that. Did Fiarmo sent you? Yes. I'll tell everyone we're ready, but we'll start the festival at dusk. Come talk to me after dark. We'll get the festival started when you do. Okay. Hey. Ah, I'll tell it. 
Come talk to me after dark. I thought it is we'll after dark. The festival dark. started when you do. It's freaking seven o'clock at night. Great. Looks like you'll be one of us soon. We'll gather outside the college for the burning of King Olaf. And maybe it's my rampant drinking, but I do not remember applying to the Bard's College. Help! I like the pretty lights. I heard you're the reason we get to have this. Thank you. You might as well have some sweets. I made them for the festival, after all. You are okay. the best of the fun. You should hear him sing. Might as well have some First sweets. Paid for by the I made them for the festival, after all. Time to party. Do I want... Free, Get come back for more! Festival Get candy. your meat pies! Come on, light the fire. Not enough wine at this party, Viermo. Welcome to Solitude, home of the arts here in Skyrim. May song speed you along. Hey, let's get this party started. There's not Somebody enough booze. Somebody help! My money is on the big one. Hurry up! What the? Fine. I'll start this party. Welcome, people of solitude. We of the Bard's College are pleased to be here to celebrate the burning of King Olaf. I just burned the him. The festival would not have been possible without the dedication and hard work of our latest applicant. I did not apply. With the lighting of the effigy... You mean this? Let's remember the Bard's College. Please welcome our newest Bard. I am not a Bard. I'm a Barbarian. But if you must, you can call me a Bardbarian. like you. Yes, congratulations. You are now a full-fledged member of the Bard's College. Due to your adventurous nature, several of the college professors have some things they wish you to do. What's more, Elisif has declared the burning of King Olaf should become a weekly event. What? And finally, there's the matter of the patronage that Elisif wanted me to give you. Seriously, she wants to throw a boring ass party like this every week. Well, I think we should end it here. This party was quite the disappointment. But, if you guys liked what you saw, hit that like and subscribe button for me, and I will see you in the next video.